What happens when fame meets a cold, unforgiving reality? Tragedy happened, but it could have happened in anybody's house. I had nothing to do with her death. Some celebrities once adored by millions ended their lives behind bars where their fame couldn't save them. These aren't just stories of downfall. They're cautionary tales of how far some stars fell, trapped in a world of crime and consequence. From shocking trials to mysterious deaths, their final moments were anything but glamorous. Get ready as we uncover the infamous stories of famous people who died in jail. Have you ever wondered how a music genius could fall so far from grace? Phil Spector, the legendary producer behind iconic hits like Be My Baby, died in prison on January 16, 2021. His wall of sound changed the music world, but behind the fame lurked a darker side. In 2009, he was convicted for the murder of actress Lana Clarkson, and his final years were spent in isolation. The man who once crafted melodies for legends died from complications related to COVID-19 while serving a 19-year sentence. Spectre's legacy is bittersweet. His influence on music is undeniable, but his fall from grace remains a tragic reminder of a life lost to violence. What happens when one of the world's most connected men ends up behind bars? Jeffrey Epstein, the disgraced financier and convicted sex offender, was found dead in his jail cell on August 10, 2019, under suspicious circumstances. Known for his high-profile connections and his role in a sex trafficking ring involving minors, his death by apparent suicide shocked the world. But questions still linger. Did Epstein take his own life, or was there more at play? His passing ignited a storm of conspiracy theories, leaving many of his crimes unresolved and the world demanding answers about how such a powerful figure met his end in prison. What drives a tech millionaire to a prison cell and ultimately to his death? John McAfee, the antivirus software pioneer, lived a life filled with controversy, paranoia, and legal troubles. On June 23, 2021, he was found dead in his Spanish jail cell while awaiting extradition to the United States on tax evasion charges. His colorful personality, known for wild escapades and cryptic tweets, made him a global figure. But his sudden death sparked conspiracy theories, much like Epstein. McAfee had claimed he would never take his own life, leaving the world wondering, was it or did his enemies finally catch up to him? How does a rising NFL star end up serving life in prison? Aaron Hernandez, once a tight end for the New England Patriots, was convicted of murder in 2015, a fall from grace that stunned the sports world. He was found dead in his prison cell on April 19, 2017, at just 27 years old, in what was ruled as <laughs> Hernandez's life was a tragic tale of talent overshadowed by violence, gang ties, and a hidden struggle with mental health, including chronic traumatic encephalopathy, CTE. His story remains one of the most shocking and heartbreaking examples of potential wasted behind bars. What happens when the powerful fall? Max Clifford, once a renowned publicist who controlled the media narrative for the UK's biggest celebrities, died in prison on December 10, 2017, while serving an eight-year sentence for historic sexual offenses. His manipulation of public perception couldn't save him from justice. Clifford collapsed in his cell from a heart attack, 
a fittingly tragic end for a man who had built his career on managing scandals. His fall from the top echoed the rise of the number Me Too movement, and his death in prison serves as a stark reminder of the reckoning faced by those who abuse their power. Can the man who created the Backstreet Boys and NSYNC truly die forgotten behind bars? Lou Pearlman, the mastermind behind some of the biggest boy bands of the 90s, also orchestrated one of the largest Ponzi schemes in history. After defrauding investors of over $300 million, he was sentenced to 25 years in prison. Pearlman died in custody on August 19, 2016, from heart complications. His downfall was as spectacular as his rise, and his death left a complicated legacy. On one hand, he revolutionized pop music. On the other, he betrayed countless people who trusted him with their savings. How does a man become the face of one of the largest financial crimes in history? Bernie Madoff, the infamous architect of a $65 billion Ponzi scheme, died in prison on April 14, 2021, while serving a 150-year sentence. His greed destroyed thousands of lives, yet in the end, he died in relative obscurity, suffering from kidney disease. Madoff's scandal rocked the financial world and left a trail of devastation that still reverberates. For many, his death offered little closure as the full impact of his fraud continues to affect families and institutions to this day. How does one of the most promising football careers end in a prison tragedy? Lawrence Phillips, a former NFL running back, was a gifted athlete whose life was marred by violent outbursts and criminal behavior. Convicted of multiple charges, including assault and domestic violence, Phillips was serving time for the murder of his cellmate when he was found dead in his cell on January 13, 2016. His death, ruled as <laughs> marked the end of a life filled with promise but overshadowed by demons he couldn't outrun. Phillips remains a tragic example of wasted talent and the destructive power of unchecked violence. What happens when the son of a wrestling legend meets a tragic end behind bars? Brian Christopher, the son of WWE Hall of Famer Jerry the King Lawler, was found dead in his jail cell on July 29, 2018, in what was ruled as a <laughs> Known for his charisma as Grandmaster Sexay in the WWE's Attitude Era, his life spiraled into addiction and legal troubles after his wrestling career faded. His death left the wrestling world mourning another talent lost too soon, while questions about mental health and addiction in the wrestling community continue to linger. These stories remind us that fame offers no escape from justice, and for some, the price they paid was the ultimate one, dying behind bars. Which of these stories shocked you the most? Share your thoughts in the comments, and don't forget to subscribe for more revealing stories about the darker side of fame. There's always more to uncover, so stay tuned for our next video.